And we begin with breaking news in Ellis County. Three children found dead and two others rushed to a hospital with stab wounds. Sources tell us the suspect is the children's mother and is in custody tonight. Police have been at a home in Italy since four this afternoon. That's located off I-35, about 40 miles south of Dallas. WFAA's Matt Howerton joins us live after speaking to relatives and investigators tonight. Matt. Yeah, Cynthia, I don't know how to say this here, but um, what happened here on this street in this tiny community behind me is simply unfathomable. A mother, police say, stabbing her own children, three of them to death. Police still on scene here tonight telling us that all this happened around 4 p.m. this afternoon. And believe me when I tell you, something like this that happened on this tiny street in this tiny community has sent a titanic shockwave through so many here in Italy, Texas. So far, what we know tonight, it is unknown what sparked the killings, but WFAA sources telling us the mother stabbed her children when a CPS worker who suspected the mom was having unsupervised visitations arrived at a home on the street where the children lived to check on everyone unannounced. The children, we were told, were living with another relative at the time. The kids living here under the supervision of another relative, as we said, police telling us that CPS worker called 911 when she found all of them dead. Three of the children, all young, two more taken to the hospital. Their injuries unknown tonight. Police not saying much else. We don't know the name of the mother or what charges she's facing right now. Our cameras did capture a group praying outside the home moments ago. As we said, everyone here very upset, shocked. A relative who babysat the kids spoke with us tonight saying she remembers holding the children like it was just yesterday. And I just want everybody to know them are some beautiful angels. Oh, I and I love him, him. and I know God, oh, God. He can never yeah. make no mistake. Yeah. And I just want to say, they gained their wings. And this is something that hurts so bad. And CPS sent us this statement tonight saying we are shocked by this incomprehensible tragedy and already working with law enforcement to investigate how this happened and why. As we said, this community rocked. A small vigil was held down the street after the killings to just stand for this family and this community, letting them know that they are with them at this time. News like this travels fast through a small town and everyone is feeling the hurt. This a major story and a tragic one at that that we'll be following for days. And we'll bring you more updates when we learn them. In Italy tonight, I'm Matt Howerton.